welcome back to Team of Sickle Mermaid Light. Please feel free to share, comment, like, and subscribe. It will greatly help your girl out. Don't forget to hit that like button. Hey, lovelies. This is going to be a pick a card reading on what it is that you need to know at this time. All right. So, you guys, we're going to choose from just one, two, or three, okay? So, whatever number is standing out to you, um, choose it, okay? And so we're gonna start with option one, obviously. And we're gonna stop, then we're going to, I'm trying to think if I wanna do anything extra for this reading. I think we're just gonna keep it simple. We're just gonna talk about what it is you need to know at, the, at this time, what's next for you, okay? Um, I feel like a lot of new energy coming in, so we're gonna focus more on what's next for you, all right? Now, I do want to mention I am open for personal readings. Please feel free to email me at mysticalmermaidlight at gmail.com. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe, guys. Come on. I can see who's all watching my videos um, via YouTube Studio. And I can tell that we get a lot of, like, people coming through my, um, I said we, wow. Um, I can see that I have a lot of people coming to my channel and watching my videos, but then they leave. Um, so there's a, there's a lot more views than subscribes and likes. So can we get that up? Can we get the number going up? That would be a beautiful energy exchange, especially if you enjoyed the reading. So, um, or if it resonated, all right. So I would greatly appreciate it so that I can, you know, continue to do readings like these. All right. So with that being said, Please hit the like button and the subscribe button. And thank you very much. I'm sending you guys love. Let's get started on option one. Option one, what's next? What's next? What do you need to know? What's next? What's next for you guys? Option one, Holy Spirit, one card at a time. Gratitude. Appreciate present blessings. Very beautiful card. Okay, what's next for option one, Holy Spirit? I just heard you have no idea. Wow. I just heard the fruitfulness, the blessings, the abundance. Never get it twisted. You are beyond blessed. Blessed beyond measure is what I just heard. You have no idea. You may not see it right now, but there's some great things that are happening for you. I just heard it's already been planned. It's already been prepared. Hood love, community. Look at that card. Community, hood love. Being grateful for the community, community you have. I see you guys spending more time with the community. Yeah, oh, supervision. You guys are going to be spending more time with Soul Tribe. That's a masculine feminine energy. That's the yin and the yang right there in that, in that card. So sun and the moon dancing together. There's something with community. We have Sarki. Stability. Yes. You have stability here, you guys. This is very powerful. What's next? Trustworthy, trustworthy soul tribe. You being in a grateful mood and energy because of the blessings that you already have something's gonna happen where you're gonna be like i'm blessed like i have more than enough i'm blessed i'm grateful i'm thankful that's the energy you're gonna be in very mindful let's see You have my booty key. And then you have higher per perception, passion. Following your dreams and passions. There's something that's going to bring you. The key to stability is following your heart. It's following your dreams and passions, your goals. The key to stability is being grateful for what you already have. The key to stability is letting your trustworthy soul tribe and community in. Let them in. Let them know how you feel, what you've been going through, what's bothering you. Oh, 
What's next? Whoa. One card. Traffic cone caution. Firefly wonder. And I just heard it. And I wonder if you know what it means to find your dreams. I wonder, is it Kanye? Kanye West. That song is coming up. Yeah, recycle, recover. You'll recover from this. Because you're being divinely guided. I just heard all is will. There's so many blessings that are lining up for you. Tap into your passions. Tap into things that make you happy. The things that make you grateful to wake up in the morning to, to be a part of. This is kind of like a, how do I say this? There may be some alchemy involved in this reading because I do feel like a little bit of, I don't know why I want to say merging, merging or weaving, like, like something's being created in the 5D as we speak about this. What's next for you? for some of you there's a visitation that's happening very soon from the higher realms i know that's scary i didn't know i was trying to figure out how to word it like how do i say this because not everyone even though this is a spiritual like tarot you know is spiritual not everyone is I hate using the word spiritual. Not everyone is as, you know, I'm open-minded. But I feel like you guys are going to have some type of, like, like, visitation from some type of, some type of either an angel, archangel, a galactic being, or possibly even a past on loved one. But I, I feel like it's a little bit different. There's some type of wish that's going to be granted to you. Just stay in gratitude. There's some great things coming your way and some new new souls. I just are new friends. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to get you guys one more card. It's very powerful. I will provide living water. Within you resides the living water of life and love. Make the choice to drink deeply from this place. Can you visualize it brimming with fullness? Hmm. You guys, I keep getting... They're playing <laughs> jokes. They're, they keep playing push it to the limit. Push it to the limit. Da, 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 da. That's Rick Ross. I got that in another reading recently. It's like, I know my worth. I know my passions. I know the things that are on my heart. I have the key. I'm moving towards it. I have a vision. I'm going to aim towards it. I claim stability. I have a trustworthy community around me. My community is my team. And I'm grateful for all that I have. That's kind of the vibe I'm getting. So you guys, what's happening next? Some great things are happening next for you. I feel that, how do I explain this? I feel that you guys are coming into yourself a little bit more. Meaning that the more you're authentic with yourself, the more it allows people to be authentic with you. So let's see. Yeah. There yeah they are when i say they i feel like your spiritual team is saying hmm. they are beyond proud of you but they need you to know that life isn't slowing down
I feel like there's travel coming up for you guys. There's something about travel. Yeah. Travel. The void. But I don't I have to wonder if this is even actual physical travel. Or if this is spiritual travel. Or both. Because there's something about this reading that's like. Hmm. But it's beautiful. It's a blessing. So that's what I have for you guys who chose option one. Let's get into option two. Option two, let's see what you have. Mystery, secrets, and hidden meanings. Black hat, huh? All right, let's see. What's next? What does option two need to know? The king of cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Tapping into your emotions. Tapping into that water energy. Whoa, we have king of swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Well, I got the hiccups as I said that. So we have the king of swords. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, very strategic, very strategic, very um, analytical, critical sometimes. We have the Five of Swords as someone who's been through the pain in the past. So they're saying you, you shall overcome. You will overcome the past. You will move forward into brighter territories. If some of you guys have been worried about finances or a past pain, like been left out in the cold or maybe hurt or betrayed by someone, do know that that's being taken care of. Know that that's being taken care of. Like whatever that is that's going wrong is being taken care of. I should only get that. Yep. Stay strong. Whatever you guys have gone through is, is being taken care of. Ooh, you got, you've been watched over. You got some help. There's a train. I don't think you guys can hear it anymore. I think that was it. There is a train in the background and it's 4, 10 a.m. It doesn't make sense. You guys, there's knowledge. Some of you guys could be um, reading a new book. I just heard reading a new book. It's something that's going to like give you, I'm hearing tips and little things that you can hold on for the rest of your life. Little jewels. Because I'm getting someone say, and they're older in age, say, oh, I, I read that book in my 20s and I love it. I still have it. And it's this old book. So I'm getting the vibe of, you guys are going to be getting out of a, a, this energy of abandonment or feeling lonely or feeling um, like lack mentality. You guys are going to be getting out of that energy. And this abandonment issues need to be healed and resolved. And then we have the king of cups with the king of swords. One, one king leads with his heart. The other lead, leads with his mind. And if only they could both lean with each other together. How, does that, how, how do I say this? If the king of swords... Can, could balance out his mind and his heart. And if the king of cuts could balance out his mind, his heart and his mind, this would be a good pairing. So what's next? You guys are going to be healing. You guys are going to be focusing on balance and healing is what I'm getting. Hmm. Balance and healing. What's happening here? What's next? You're going to be forgiving of the past, you guys. Forgiving others from the past. Yeah. You're going to be focusing more on gratitude. Gratitude for how far you've come. Even though there's a lot that's unknown. You're going to be focusing on peace. 
guidance. You're going to receive guidance. What is it? Ye though I walk through the valley of shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me, thou ride in thy staff, thy comfort me, thou preparest the table before me in the presence of my enemies. That's the vibe I'm getting. Vision keeps coming out. This came out in the other option. Karma, see? You reap what you sow. So you guys, make sure your karma is A1. That's what I just heard. Make sure you... Make sure you're on the up and ups with everything that you do and with how you treat people. Silent retreat, silence. Some of you guys might think about taking a vow of silence. There's something about a... Some... How do I say this? There's someone that's going to come in if there's, if you guys aren't ready or ready with someone, someone's going to come in and they're going to take your mind off of things. Now, I see you guys want to get a lot done. So you may see this as a little bit of a distraction, but have compassion and mercy. People just want to be a part of your life. They don't know. They don't know any better. Okay. I don't know why I feel called to say that. You have alignment, magic, see? Aligning with, I feel like you guys are going to be facing some things. Facing abandonment issues, facing lack, lack of mentality. Some of you guys could even be facing anything in regards to health. Like making sure you're on, on top of your health and well-being. hear that it's a train i'm telling you like there's something about trains here secrets and hidden blessings secrets and hidden messages there's something that's coming your way under the moonlight so this could be a full moon or a new moon Okay, the judgment call here, there's angelic presences coming through, prophecies being given, shared. It's a huge shift in your life. And they're not saying much, they're just saying it's a huge shift. A huge shift. The I heard the old me is dead and gone. Isn't that a song with Usher? Not Usher, oh my God, why did I say Usher? With Justin Timberlake. NTI. That's deep. Okay. You guys, that's what I have. This mystery, secrets, and hidden meanings. It'll be revealed to you. There's signs everywhere. There's messages everywhere. But this is going to be revealed to you quite soon. Quite soon. Okay. So that's what I have for you guys. Option two. If you liked this reading, feel free to share, comment, like, subscribe. We're moving on to option three. Option three. What do you need to know during this time? Healing. Allow light to enter your wounds. Wow. Sun gazing. Spending time in the sun. Let the sun touch your skin. It will help you. It will give you energy. You guys have the divine feminine, the void. You have food meditation, I can. You guys, there's something with the body needing to eat healthier. There's something, look at how they're both kind of in this energy, this awe kind of energy. But they're both needing to take care of themselves.
I just heard goddess energy, god goddess energy. Some of you guys could be tapping into tapping into higher power, but I'm getting starseed energy in this reading too. Yeah, speak and we have Oya protection here. See, I feel that let's see. I feel like you guys are about to level up a sin so for a lot of you what's next is that your body may shift and change you may not want some of the same foods you used to eat i feel like you may not want some of the things you used to want or crave i know it sounds strange but it's not it's not even how do i say it it's not even the deepest part of it there's something deeper here i'm hearing dna activations what is this Enchantment, celebration. You're being invited to a celebration. Something about food, drink, celebration. Because what's clicking, what's standing out to me is that there's food and drinks here, right? Even... A little party favor. So I'm getting something about a celebration, a party. Maybe someone's birthday or your birthday. There's something about a celebration coming and celebrating the divine feminine. Yeah. What do you need to know next? A room, joy, and light. Your spiritual team wants you guys to have more fun. They want you to get out there, but they want you to be mindful. There are certain things that they're they're taking out of your life. I'm hearing habits. So that you can evolve, okay? Um, and I feel like certain foods, like, you're naturally going to be like, I don't want it. Like, no. Look at that. You guys have Oshun Justice. You guys have Iku Transformation. Strong, strong spiritual things happening with you guys. And then we have Healing. There is so much power in this reading. It's so mystical. What's next for you guys? I'm curious to see what's next. Love. <laughs> Love of thyself. Love of thyself. Connection with thyself. Your frequency is raising. I don't know what else to say to you guys. Your frequency is shifting to a higher level. The only thing is that you guys are going to need to stay grounded here on earth. I, I feel like you guys are going to be so wrapped up in what's shifting and changing within you and around you. And even spiritually that you're going to forget that you actually have a, a life here on earth. Like, oh, I got matters to take care of. Oops, I was supposed to take care of this. So...
What's next? A peace of mind, a pure heart, highest frequency of love shifts, eating healthier. Your body is going to push out foods that it no, it, like it's going to push away foods that it doesn't want anymore. It's not a frequency sh like alignment to them. It's not an alignment. They're telling me to get one more card, okay? Just let me get one more card. I was trying to read it, see what, what else I'm getting there. It's a lot of love and beauty. Messages. Oh, the whole deck wanted to fly, you guys. Like, there's distractions that might get in the way, but there's definitely some met type of message that's trying to come through to you guys. We have feathers here. So you guys might start seeing feathers as messages. Like, there's a message coming. And look, we have calorie shell abundance. That's very powerful. I love that. What are you abundant? Enjoy peace, good health, prosperity, love, you know? Like, there's some good stuff coming you guys' way. Some really good stuff. I see you guys forgiving more, healing more. These are powerful cards. Celebration. There's a lot to celebrate in this deck. I mean, in this option. If you like this reading, share, like, comment, subscribe. That's what I have for you guys. Have a good one.